Maybe we should draw him a clown nose because only clowns cry? It's very strange to hear these words from the most important crybaby in our team. Now this guy will sleep more pleasantly. I know exactly what he is missing. Oh! No, no, no! Remove this quickly before YouTube bans us for this! To find out what's in my room, you need to like and subscribe! Come on, I'm waiting! Well, three, two, one. Um, guys, I'll come back later. Hello, Hello everyone, friends, and today we will again play a game called Just Draw. Why did this game even decide to give us a hint? We ourselves understand that we need to draw a flower here. Jax is pretty good at drawing. This flower looks almost real. Well, we dealt with this flower quite quickly, and now let's move on to the next task. The fly is stuck in the web, but there is no spider. It seems to me that we need to draw him so that he will eat it. It looks too cruel. I think it would be better if they drew scissors with which they would cut the web and free the fly. But now this spider has food and we can draw the following picture. This snowman of mine is definitely missing something. I think we should draw him a hat or something. Looks like he doesn't really like this hat. Maybe we should draw some other bucket type hat on our head. Now he looks like a royal guard. Do you know with these weird and furry hats? Looks like he's not of royal blood. Maybe then we can draw horns for him. Maybe he will like it. Now it's a snowman reindeer. But this option doesn't suit him either. I know exactly what he is missing. Oh, no, no, no. Remove this quickly before YouTube bans us for this. Seriously. Hat? We already drew his hat. Maybe he needs a tricorn hat. Oh my god, this hat doesn't suit this guy either. Okay, let's try to draw the neatest square hat possible. Maybe we should draw him a hat with ear flaps. Maybe it's a Russian snowman or something like that. Let's try to do this. Oh my god, he doesn't like this hat either. Buddy, why are you such a picky dude? Seriously, did he need a damn top hat? Oh my god, this guy really gave us a hard time. I hope this version of the hat suits him. Well, finally, Lord, I no longer believe that we could do this. Now let's draw a bucket here. We already tried to draw a bucket in the previous level. I hope in this level everyone will like the bucket that we will draw. Okay, this really looks like a real bucket, and we coped with this level too. Now, we're moving to the next level. Looks like tools are falling on this guy. I think we need to protect his bald head. Let's make some kind of barrier or something like that. It looks quite strange, but now I think this guy will definitely be protected. Perhaps the developers of this level wanted us to draw a helmet? I think it's time for her to wake up, but it's an owl. She needs to see the moon in order to stay awake at night. Let's draw her. This moon is really very similar to the real one. I hope she wakes up the owl. Just look at how funny her face is. This guy lost some of his glasses somewhere. Let's restore them. I think you can draw a round lens here. This guy's not happy with what we did. Maybe we didn't draw an even enough circle? Okay, let's try to redraw it. This time he doesn't like what we did either. Maybe he wants a different lens? Oh my god, what more does this guy need? Maybe let's try to draw a perfect circle? We already tried to do this, but it didn't work. He still doesn't like his lens. Let's make it square. This guy is starting to piss me off. We tried all the options. Nothing suits him. Seriously? Triangle? Buddy, your choice of glasses is too idiotic. Well, we were finally able to help this idiot with the weird hair color and weird glasses, and now we're moving on to the next level. This guy is sitting and drinking something. What is he missing? Um, maybe he doesn't have enough food? Let's draw a cucumber for this guy. Maybe he's just sitting there drunk and hungry? It turns out that this guy is just an alcoholic and he lacks a wine bottle next to him. Okay, it was worth guessing, but I had a better opinion of him. Great, we were able to help this French alcoholic and now let's help this woman. It seems to me that in order to help her, it is enough to remove her from this room so that she does not interfere with this rocker listening to music. It looks like this option is not suitable for us. We still need to help this girl. Let's draw this guy some headphones. Looks like this option doesn't suit anyone either. Well then, I think we can draw big headphones on his head that both he and she will like. And this option suits them. Great! And now we need to help this sad bottle and draw a glass friend for it. I think I'm making a pretty ugly glass, but I hope he's happy with this Mr. Bottle. It looks like he's happy with everything. Great! I'm glad we were able to make him happy. Now let's help this guy on the island who is very sick from the heat. We need to draw him a huge umbrella or something like that that can protect him from the sun's rays. Cool. And this umbrella helped him. Now this guy can have a normal rest on the island. Well, now we need to help this guy. Maybe we need to draw a sleep bandage for him. Now this guy will sleep more pleasantly, but it seems to me that this is not exactly what he needs. Well then, let's try to wake him up. To do this, we need to draw an alarm clock. Seriously? Doesn't he like this alarm clock? Well then, I don't know what we need. This guy is not happy with everything. He's definitely a clown. Seriously? Alarm? We already drew an alarm clock for him. Maybe he needs a bigger alarm clock? 
Oh my god, this guy is impossible to please. We're even trying to finish the legs for this alarm clock. He's still not happy with it. Seriously? Our only problem was that we didn't draw a big enough alarm clock? Okay, let's just trace these lines. Wake up, Boar! Now you have a new giant alarm clock. Well, now we need to help Jax's friend. This guy's very hungry. I think the carrots should definitely make him full. Cool, we helped him. I think this knight is in a little trouble. In order to cope with this dragon, he just needs a weapon. We drew this sword just perfectly, but it's strange that it's purple. Wow! Now this knight has defeated the dragon. Buddy, how did you end up losing your ear? Do you think someone bit it off? But it seems to me that when your ear is bitten off, your facial expression is a little different. We need to erase this black line so that his ear appears solid. Great, now this guy hears twice as good. Buddy, what are you missing? Maybe we should draw him a clown nose because only clowns cry? It's very strange to hear these words from the most important crybaby in our team, but it seems to me that this is not the best option. Let's try to sketch his tears. I think this definitely won't help us either. Maybe it's this guy's birthday and we should draw him a birthday hat. Oh my god, buddy, what is your problem? Just tell us how we can help you. I'm tired of him. I will draw a tongue for him so that it seems that he is not only sad, but also sour. It seems to me that the problem is completely different. Candy? Seriously? Was this guy crying just because he didn't have candy? I am absolutely sure that this tree is missing a star at its very top. No Christmas tree is complete without a star at the top. I don't think this game really likes the star that Jax drew. Maybe you should try to draw it not like a pentagram? But in general, he used the simplest way to draw a star. It's very strange that the game didn't like this method. I hope this star suits her. Now we saved someone's Christmas. Well, let's help the next person. Oh my god. Buddy, what happened to your hand? Where did you lose it? Wait, do they really want us to draw him a new hand? Um, okay. Let's try to do this. I think it looks more like a fork than a hand, but this guy seems to be okay with it. Well, the main thing is that he is happy, and now we will help the next person complete what he is missing. It seems to me that some mistake occurred during the construction of this house, and the builders made the foundation too large. Well, let's add a lift for this guy so he can get up and go into his house. I think the steps will be enough for him. He will be able to install the elevator himself while we help this guy. And now he's home. Now... Oh my god, what's going on here? This guy lost his sock. I think we should add a second sock to him because this guy looks pretty ridiculous wearing just one sock. I think we drew the outline slightly wrong. It may not be the right size. Ooh, I think this guy likes him too much. Look at what rack he's standing in. This stance is very unnatural for a man with such hairy legs. Well, now let's help this guy. Claws like Wolverine's will definitely be better than any watch. Just imagine how cool you can be if you have these claws. Looks like this guy didn't like those claws at all. Well, then let's add him a like so that he definitely likes everything. Dear friends, don't forget to like our videos too. Well, he didn't like this option. I think then we'll add a watch to him so he looks like all his other friends. By the way, friends, do you know who else among us is a fan of various wristwatches? Now the shadow of this character will appear on your screen and you pause this video and write in the comments who it is. I hope you answer correctly. Well guys, have you written your comments? And the correct answer will appear on the screen in three, two, one. And yes, you were right, it's Kinger. In fact, we are all tired of showing off our watches. He has a whole collection of them and we can't explain to him that we really don't care at all. By the way, all this time the game does not count Jax for all his attempts to draw a clock. He's tried to do this many times already, but I think it's time for us to try to simply skip this level and stop torturing ourselves. Great! You and I have done this, and now we need to finish drawing the head of this skeleton. How did he even manage to lose her? Are you even sure that you are drawing a skeleton skull? It looks more like some kind of champignon over a square or something like that. Okay, the main thing is that the game counted this for us as a correct answer. And now let's warm up this Neanderthal. I think we should draw him a very bright sun. It should definitely warm him up. It seems to me that this is not quite what he needed. Hmm. Maybe then he should draw him a fire. It should definitely warm him up. The main thing is that this guy doesn't accidentally approach this fire and get burned. He's a Neanderthal, and he doesn't know how to use it. Great. Now this guy not only warmed up, but was also able to warm up his food. We helped him. And now let's help the next person. I really want to draw the sun on this guy so that his eyes burn out. You know you can't look at the sun through a telescope, right? It's a pity that the game didn't count this as the correct answer. Let's now erase this and draw a star for him so he can admire it. 
my friend, to be honest, this is the most disgusting star I've ever seen in my life. Try drawing it again a little smoother. I think you should do well. And I already like this star much more. Just look. Jax had to draw a star three times today, and the third time he got it almost perfect. Well, now we have to help this guy draw a triangle. This guy really can't handle this task himself? I think this is the easiest task in the world. Just draw a triangle. Perhaps this guy is slightly mentally retarded, but in any case, the main thing is that we were able to help him. Now we need to help this guy, and I can't understand what he needs. Let's draw him a monitor. It seems to me that this is not the most ideal monitor, but in any case, it should help him. No, unfortunately, this is not exactly what he needs. Maybe we can try to draw a better monitor? It seems to me that the problem here is absolutely not in the monitor. This guy has huge bags under his eyes and it is quite possible that he is very tired. I think he needs some kind of boost of energy. Maybe we can draw him a cup of coffee? This guy looks a lot like our editor. Right now, our editor is also working all night to create a video for you guys. Write him some nice words in the comments and be sure to like this video. It doesn't exactly look like a coffee mug. Let's try to draw a bigger mug, and we definitely need to draw the steam that comes out of it from the top. This coffee should be hot. I'm definitely sure that's what we need to do. This is about just look how we were able to cheer up this guy. Well, this task was quite difficult, but we did it and... What? Why doesn't this guy have a leg? Guys, where do you keep losing all your limbs? Um... Jax, I think you drew too many fingers, don't you think so? Oh, I think this guy is quite happy with his new leg. This leg looks like it's mutated. Well, now let's add a keyboard to this guy so he can write nice comments to us. Guys, why don't you write us comments under the video? Don't you have a keyboard? If this solved the problem, I would draw a keyboard for each of our subscribers. Oh, I think this guy is missing an emergency evacuation button. Well, okay. Let's not argue with this, and let's just draw a button to save this guy. Great. He was able to fly away by parachute. I hope that the next task will be more difficult than the previous one. Oh, look! This big guy doesn't have enough food on his plate. Well, I think he will be very happy if we draw a burger for him. I think this burger is definitely missing something. There should be at least two buns. Great. Now this guy will be happy. I think this guy has a hearing problem. Let's try to finish drawing him a new ear. I think the game will ask you to finish drawing him a pretty giant ear. Well, but now he will hear his friend well. Is this the foot of Santa Claus? It seems to me that walking in the snow without shoes is not the best idea. Great. Now his feet will definitely not freeze. Ow! Just look! This astronaut went into space without a spacesuit. We need to quickly finish drawing his spacesuit so that he doesn't suffocate. Let's draw a circle around his head. Great job, guys. The astronaut is saved, and now we move on to the next level. This guy feels extremely insecure. It says that you need to finish drawing his crown. Well, maybe we can finish drawing a halo for him. I don't think this is the best idea, but it's worth a try. Let's add another glow effect around it. Well, I don't think he looks happy. I think we need to erase everything we drew and try to draw something else. Let's try to draw glasses for him. Maybe he just doesn't see well. Are you guys serious? It says there to draw him a crown. What in the word crown is not clear to you? Okay, let's just draw him a crown and move on to the next level. This crown has too many spikes. Do you think he will like her? He seemed to really like her. This is cool. Let's now help the next person. We need to help him get the ball into the basket. Guys, there is a basketball fan among us too. Now the shadow of this character will appear on the screen and you try to guess who it is. Write your answers in the comments. I hope you answered correctly, and the correct answer will appear on the screen in 3, 2, 1, and yes, you guessed it right again, it's Jax! And I think this ball is quite crooked, but it seems that this does not bother him and he is happy even with this ball. This woman had a fire, I think we need to help her eliminate it! I don't think this is a good idea, the fire still continues to burn, we need water! I think we need to come up with something that will help us put out the fire in her apartment! Exactly, we need a fireman! Try to draw him as similar to a fireman as possible. We need to save this girl from the burning house. He looks quite a lot like a fireman. Well, I hope that he will be able to put out this fire and we will save this girl. Let's just draw a ladder for her to go down and escape from the fire. I think this is the best idea out of all the ones proposed. Let's just do it and let her come down. Great! The staircase is ready, the girl is saved, and we are moving to the next level. Here we need to help the guy with his crazy twitching eye. Maybe we can just give him an eye patch? Kind of like pirates, you know? Yes, it also seems to me that his eye should be hidden. He twitches madly and scares everyone who looks at him. It's definitely very creepy. 
It seems to me that this is not exactly what needs to be done. Maybe we should finish drawing the frame of his glasses. This may help his eyes stop twitching. Wow, that really helped. Only now his nostril began to twitch. It's quite strange, but the main thing is that now this guy is happy. Are you really drawing this guy a bra? I don't think this is quite what he needs. There is a logic to this. Maybe Jax is actually drawing him a swimsuit? So this guy will be fully dressed. The game tells you that this guy needs to draw shorts. Well, okay, let's do this. Hope this helps this guy get dressed. Great, now this guy has shorts. Wait, where is him? Um, okay, never mind. Now this guy is dressed and we move on to the next level. Oh my god, this guy's feet really stink. We urgently need to put socks on him. You're so careful around his leg, Jax. Are you afraid that you won't be able to draw socks in his size? The socks seem to fit his foot perfectly. Well, now let's help this guy dig up the treasure. He definitely needs a shovel for this. Let's draw a shovel for him so that this guy can become rich and buy himself a new jacket that will be cooler than the one he is wearing now. I didn't like his strange green jacket either. She looks like he's a leprechaun. Okay, now we need to add a new wheel to this poor car. I'm so sorry about the machine. She's crying because she doesn't have a wheel. Don't worry, machine. We drew you a new wheel and now you can go wherever you want. And this teapot is angry because he pours all the tea into the plate. Hey, buddy, I think you're missing a cup here. Great, this is the perfect mug for tea and now this teapot is happy. I'm glad we were able to help him. Now we need to help this crying plate. I think she doesn't have enough food. Let's draw a piece of delicious chicken on it. I think this should calm down this crying plate a little. Our pencil draws in gray. I think the gray chicken won't look too appetizing. Perhaps we are doing something wrong? Yes, it looks like this plate was not happy. Maybe we should draw a fork next to it or something like that? Yes, she missed a fork nearby. Well, this is quite logical. Who even eats with just a knife? Here you need to complete the missing geometric figure. I think a triangle would be the right solution. And now we need to help this girl hide from the rain. How about drawing an umbrella to prevent these drops from falling on her? Purple umbrella? It looks quite glamorous, but quite strange. I hope she will be happy with this umbrella. Now this lady won't get wet. It's great that we were able to do this, and she looks pretty happy now. Oh no, look, it's a crying monkey. We need to help her. Perhaps she wants to eat. Let's draw her a banana. It doesn't exactly taste like a banana, but I think she's happy about it. Well, I'm very glad that we were able to make this monkey happy. This guy is crying among the mustachioed men. Buddy, don't worry. We will give you a gorgeous hairstyle, and you will become cooler than these bald guys. It looks like he's still not happy. Well, then we'll give you a mustache, but it will be cooler than these guys. Now you look like, um, Charlie Chaplin. He didn't like that mustache either. Okay, maybe this is an elegant option then? But he really liked this mustache, great! Are we really going to get a manicure now? Wait, buddy, are you serious? It looks a little weird when a guy sits and gets his nails done. Don't you think so? I think it's a pretty relaxing activity. Just look at how shiny this coating is. It looks very nice. I really miss manicures because we don't do them in our amazing digital circus, so I can enjoy it at least in this game. Now let's choose the color with which we will cover this nail. Oh, I think the last color combination will look absolutely beautiful. Kinger, how long have you become such a specialist in the field of manicure? It's quite strange to see how interested a guy is in choosing nail colors. Perhaps he is hiding something from us, but let's not question him. This is a personal matter for everyone. Now we will choose a sticker for this nail. You need to choose something that will fit perfectly with this color scheme. I think we chose the perfect option. This nail looks really cool. Let's see how the client rated it. I think they look pretty good. Three stars and we earned 140 coins for them. Cool. I wonder how much such a manicure would cost in real life. Oh, this is the next client. Let's make her nails more beautiful. What is this thing? Is it needed to shape the nail? I think it's quite convenient. I wonder how she would have managed to do it without this sticker. I think it would be almost impossible. I still remember a time when people actually used false nails. It looks very terrible and was very impractical. I feel like I'm at a girl's slumber party right now, but I can't figure out whether I like it or not. I feel a little strange. After that, I had even more questions for you, but it seems to me that it would be better if I keep them to myself. We'll just keep choosing nail designs. Let's choose a stencil with fire! Oh yeah! I think this would be the perfect option, and we'll paint this fire bright red so she can have biker nails. Buddy, tell me, how often have you seen bikers with painted nails? It seems to me that among bikers there are no such people at all. Well, I don't really like the design of these nails. 
Well, we tried ourselves as a manicurist, and now let's try on the role of a stylist. We need to make this girl beautiful. It seems to me that we have a rather strange selection of games today, don't you think so? But it seems to me that we chose great games. Wow, she has hair like my favorite TikToker, Bella Porch. Oh yeah, this looks a lot like her. I think they chose the perfect bow for her. And yes, we won. Great. I like this game too. Guys tell me this is generally normal, and I should like some other games. I will not comment on this in any way. Just keep enjoying these games with us if you really like them that much. I wonder what image we will need to repeat in the next level. Well, let's find out right now. We need to make this girl look like an angel. Well, okay, let's start. I think white hair in this body would go perfectly with this look. Oh no, my shoulder itched and I accidentally cut her hair bald. Well, I think that angels can be bald too. There is nothing wrong. Let's just continue to choose the options we need. But this seems to me to be the key choice. We need to add a halo. Great, the main thing is not... Um, seriously? Did you choose red skin color for the angel? I don't think she looks like an angel at all now. You also chose a long neck? Now she looks like a giraffe. I think now we're going to lose. But it looks like our opponent chose a much less suitable outfit. Cool! We won again. Just look at how funny she dances. Okay, let's stop playing girly games and start playing something really serious. Here we need to modify our gun. But this game is much more suitable for boys. It seems to me that it should be more interesting for them. Let's see what we need to do here. I find it very difficult to shoot down all the targets at once! We need to focus on increasing the power of our weapons! Okay, now we need to make money here. But we didn't get past the second stage. Well, let's see what we can spend this money on. American flag keychain! Looks pretty patriotic. Well, let's take this money and go to the weapon modification room. Here we can spend money on spare parts for our weapons. Let's add a silencer to our pistol. I hope now he will be able to achieve his goals much faster. Let's now see what this gun is capable of. It seems to me that this silencer did not add accuracy to this pistol, although the jacks began to hit targets a little more often. It seems to me that he just has more skill because he is already playing this game for the second time. Well, let's continue to play it and see how much we can improve our gun. It's strange that this game also interested you quite a lot. Perhaps, in fact, the fact is that you just like idiotic games like this. I wouldn't call this game idiotic because I think it's quite interesting and there aren't as many ads as in other games. It's cool that our editor removes all advertising inserts from this game so that our viewers don't have to see it. Well, let's add even more new parts to this weapon. Cool. We added an enlarged magazine and scope to it. Now let's go through the next level with our new modifications. It seems to me that we haven't added all possible spare parts yet. Cool! We also added a laser sight for this pistol. He should definitely shoot much better now. I hope we can go a little further now. Oh, there was some enemy here and we killed him. I didn't even notice it. Perhaps it's because we now have a super cool gun. You know, I like this game even more. This is probably strange. After all, I'm a girl and I should like making beautiful girls and painting nails more than improving weapons. Yes, it's really quite strange because I liked the previous games. Now let's play a game in which you need to increase this stick man. Yes, I also think it's time to end this game, and let's really move on to the next game. Here we need to make sure that this guy constantly passes through the blue portals and does not end up in the red ones. Every time he passes through the blue portal, he either becomes fatter or becomes taller, which gives him more points. I wonder if it's possible to make it so huge that it doesn't fit on the screen. Okay, here's the finish line. Let's jump on this springboard and see what happens next. Oh. Every time he touches an obstacle, he becomes smaller, and we need to get to the boss who is at the very end. Okay, first attempt was not very successful. Look, here we need to build our city with the help of the points we earn. Let's collect all these points and go through it to see what we can get here. It's very cool that there is an additional goal here instead of just collecting points to get a record. I would really like to build this city completely. There are various shops here, and it's very cool. Yes, I really like it too! Here we can also defeat other people who have fewer points and take their points for ourselves in order to place these points in buildings. Well, let's start the next game to earn even more crystals. Now Jax needs to concentrate as much as possible on not going through the red portals in order to earn as many points as possible. I hope you can do this. Oh no! You accidentally touched an obstacle! Because of this, our character has become smaller. Well, I hope that this will not interfere with our final result. I like this game even more than the previous one. It's very funny. Now let's move on to the next game.
Wow. Woo. This doesn't look right to me. Oh, God. What's going on here anyway? What kind of nonsense is this? Wait, no, 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 no. Don't tell me. Oh, God, not this. Um, finger in the socket? And why do you need a finger in this socket? Wait, don't tell me he's going to poop now. At first, I thought that this game would be difficult, but it turned out that this game is just idiotic. Hello, Hello everyone, friends, and today we will play the plug and play game. Maybe you can tell us what is the essence of this game? Do you just need to plug the plugs into the socket? In fact, there will be a lot of puzzles here that will be a little incomprehensible to us, but we will try to go through them all. Okay, let's take a look at them. So, now I see a white screen and nothing else. Here, two strange fingers appear on both sides. I think they are very long. What do we need to do here? I think the most logical option is to help them touch. But it seems to me that they go quite evenly to each other. They start missing. You need to point one of your fingers. Great. What kind of person is this and where is he running? Every time we click, he changes the direction of his running. Maybe we just need to wait for him to reach his final goal. Looks like he ran away. Well, now it's a black screen. No, wait, he came running and crashed into some invisible wall. Buddy, are you okay? Can you talk, breathe? Um, I think he's alive. Great. Oh, he gets up. I hope this guy doesn't run around like crazy anymore and the same thing doesn't happen to him again. It looks like he's still in a hurry to get somewhere and he's run away somewhere again. Wow, he disappeared behind the screen and came running from the other side. No, he fell again. But instead of him, another guy ran out of the door and was also running somewhere. Where are they all going in such a hurry? I don't understand what's really going on here. This plug fell out of this socket. Well, let's insert it again and... What happens? Some kind of button guy on a white background. He gets up too. He goes to other guys like him. There are a lot of plug guys here. This guy touched another guy and they are now touching each other. What's going on here anyway? Why? What? I don't understand anything. Why are they touching each other? What's going on here anyway? Um... Two socket guys walk towards each other, and they have wires sticking out of their heads, and what's that for? What's going on here anyway? I do not understand anything. There is definitely some meaning to this, but we don't understand it yet. Hey, just look! This guy pushed him, and now they are pushing each other. Why is this happening? What did he do to him? Well, okay! They push each other, and the last guy remains. The rest of the guys are all lying there, and... This one just went somewhere. Okay, now we have a room with some strange button. In fact, I absolutely didn't understand what was happening here, but I hope that our subscribers like it. Guys, pause and write in the comments, did you like this game? And be sure to write what games you would like us to play. I hope that you wrote the name of your favorite game in the comments. And now we need to decide what we need to do with this button. In order to go further, we have some kind of strange plug, and we need to find an outlet here. I don't see a single outlet here. This is very strange. There is only a button that turns the light on and off and nothing else. I think we need to figure something out about this. It turns out there was an outlet under this button. Great, we got it done. Well, now we have two sockets. We put a plug in there and what happens? Some guy walking on a white background. What is he doing? Now he's become the socket guy instead of the plug guy. Okay, let's plug the second plug into the socket and what? Wait. Don't tell me he's going to poop now. Not this. Oh my god. What's going on here anyway? At first I thought that this game would be difficult. But it turned out that this game is just idiotic. Okay, he pooped out some coin. And what will he do next? Um, okay. He pooped out two coins. And what should we do with them? It looks like this guy is not at all interested in this coin. Maybe we should try to somehow interact with him. It seems to me that this also does not give any results. Let's try to throw this coin the same way we threw the first coin out of frame. I think this should give some result. Oh great, we've moved on to the next location. Now this guy is coming for these coins. This is quite strange because before this he was not interested in them at all. I wonder how long we will be throwing these coins. Oh similar, now he will raise them and what will happen next? Okay, this guy is a fork man again. Now, we need to take another plug out of the socket and insert a button there instead. Well, we did it, and now let's... Oh, we got the second fork. Now, there are two buttons, and we pressed two of them. Now, some plug guy is walking towards the socket man in the dark. He met him, and it became light around. Let's talk to him. I don't really like this man, Rosette, so let's say goodbye to him. Great! He also said goodbye to us. 
We turned around and went in the other direction. Let's see what awaits us ahead. One more person socket? He greets us too. We have two options for the question. Well, let's choose this one. It looks like some kind of dialogue has started between them, but their communication looks as strange as possible. Although, what did I really want from the socket man and the plug man? It looks like some kind of romantic relationship is developing between them, but it seems to me that the love of the socket man is not mutual to the plug man. Well, this is a very sad story. She even refused him a hug. It is really very sad to watch how it hurts the plug person to receive such answers from the socket person. Well, now the socket man is gone and the plug man is left all alone. I hope depression doesn't affect him too much. It looks like this guy was really sad. I would really like to cheer him up, but we move on to the next scene. Now we need to remove these buttons from the sockets and insert a plug instead of one of the buttons. To be honest, I still absolutely don't understand the logic of this game. What's going on here and why are we even doing this? But I hope that we are not doing this in vain. Here again there are people with sockets with wires sticking out of their heads. I think we need to bring them closer to each other so that they somehow interact. Oh, they hugged. It looks very cute. I hope this is the same guy who got rejected. Oh, they took out the sockets and they connected. Why is there a third person here? I think this guy is definitely out of place here. Wait, what? Wow. Woo, this doesn't look right to me. Something very strange is definitely starting to happen in this game. Wait, no, 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 don't tell me. Oh God, not this. Do you remember I said that Pomni likes very strange games? So forget everything I said before. Country of this game I have never seen before. This is the weirdest game in the world. I simultaneously want to see what will happen next, but at the same moment, I absolutely don't want it. Oh God, what's going on here anyway? What kind of nonsense is this? It seems to me that now there is no point in calling the creators of modes in Roblox crazy. It seems to me that games about a big head are a real trifle compared to what happens in this game. I've definitely never seen stranger games in my life. It seems to me that everything that happens in this game can be explained by some deep philosophical thought, but I have absolutely no explanation for what we are actually doing here. This really looks like some kind of nonsense from a crazy person. Okay, he grabbed his finger, and what will he do next? Why does he even need this finger? Wait, what? Seriously? Did we take the finger out of this guy's hand? Okay. Now we have a finger that we can most likely insert into the socket. But why do we need it? Why do we even need a finger in the socket? What is going on here? Lord, I absolutely don't understand the meaning of what's happening on the screen now. Well, okay. This is a socket, and we need to insert our finger into it. Um, finger in the socket? And why do you need a finger in this socket? Wait, did we turn off the finger? What, what just happened here? Okay guys, I really hope that you really liked this game and understood its meaning. But for me, this game seemed a little strange. Well, now let's move on to the next game. I think it looks more like a fork than a hand. Claws like Wolverines will definitely be better than any watch. It looks more like some kind of champignon over a square or something like that. Jax, I think you drew too many fingers, don't you think so? Hello everyone, friends, and today we will again play a game in which we will need to complete the missing elements. It seems to me that this is not the ring she wanted at all. So let's remove part of his grid. I think we did it in vain. Turns out this guy really loves ballet. This is a very strange hobby for such a large man like him. Oh my god. What is this grandpa doing? I don't even want to know what he's hiding behind those bushes. Hello everyone, friends. Today we will play the game Remove One Part Again. I think it's a little hard for this guy to pull the cart. Let's see what's under that green cloth. Oh, there's some very chubby guy eating burgers. It seems to me that we need to carefully remove this tissue and look at it. Hey guy, what are you even forgetting here? I think this guy's in big trouble. Now let's move on to the next task. Oh, here a guy wants to propose to his girlfriend. Let's look at the ring he will offer her. It seems to me that this is not the ring she wanted at all. But now she will definitely cry. But this time, not because of happiness. I definitely think this guy doesn't need a cone around his neck. Let's delete it. How did he even think about putting this cone on his neck? After all, it is needed so that the animal does not scratch itself. Oh, Lord! Get that finger out of your nose! Why are you poking around in it? Oh, now we need to help this Theodore so he doesn't get run over by the bull. I think we can just remove the bull from here. Oh no, I think we did something wrong. Well, let's try to remove the tissue. Oh look, what's underneath it? What? Where did this guy get my panties? Oh, I think I said something unnecessary. Well, let's move on to the next level. 
Hey, buddy, now is not the time to sit and eat. Oh, it seems to me that your plate is not what it should be. Does this guy actually eat soup straight from the shield? I can't even imagine under what circumstances this happened, but I don't think it matters. Let's move on to the next task. I think this builder is a little tired of his work. Let's help him have some fun. Maybe we can put his instrument away? He looks pretty happy now. I think he is very glad that he now has such a thing. And now we need to help this bus get into this rather narrow tunnel. Second floor. This bus definitely has an extra one. There are just no people there. This means we can remove it. Now this bus can go through this tunnel on this road. It's cool that we were able to help these people get through this tunnel. Now let's find the monster on this plate. Monster? What do you mean? Oh, I think I get it. Here you just need to remove the bacon and it will turn out to be a funny one-eyed cute monster. Yes! This monster really turned out to be quite funny! I think this girl's eyes are too big! Oh no! I think she looked much better with big eyes! This girl really has vision problems since her lenses make her eyes look so big. Well, here I think we need to understand which of these two guys is a real werewolf. Let's check this girl out first. She has a t-shirt with dog paw prints on it. I think this definitely means something, and we can't check what's under this guy's shirt. You need to remove the clouds so that the moon shows who the real werewolf is. It's great that we helped this guy. Now let's help the zombie. I think we need to make the balls fly into the air. But for some reason, when we try to remove the threads, the balls still remain in place. Maybe we need to try to separate his hands so that the balls fly up with it? Yes, this helped us. Great. Let's move on to the next task. That guy's sledgehammer looks pretty menacing. Let's try to fix it somehow. Oh, he wants to take a selfie. I think this will be the very first selfie on our planet. This fish is hiding something from us. Let's see what's in the treasure chest. Oh, there are a lot of gold coins, but that's not what we're looking for. Maybe there is something interesting behind this coral. Oh, look, that's a very cute little crab sitting there, but he doesn't interest us either. Oh, just look, behind these algae, there is a hook. This fish turned into a ball fish when it saw him. Well, now let's move on to the next task. And here we need to help this red-bearded guy eat honey. It seems to me that it would be good to start by removing all these aggressive bees. But unfortunately, the game does not allow us to do this. So let's remove part of his grid. I think we did it in vain. Now this guy has been stung by bees. Well, sorry, buddy. But now we have to help this witch find out what's in the box. Someone prepared a prank for her to make her scared. A creepy clown jumped out of this box. Well, this is a very good joke. Now we need to help our boyfriend deliver breakfast in bed. It seems to me that this girl is not very happy that he eats this food himself. Well, it's quite possible that she was waiting for a surprise all this time. Let's take the cap off this guy. Oh, I don't think he really wants to show off his bald head. So maybe he's hiding something under his clothes? I think it definitely doesn't look like a lumberjack's outfit. Turns out this guy really loves ballet. This is a very strange hobby for such a large man like him, and now we need to understand what is hidden here under the foam. There must be a really cool Leo tattoo there. Well, let's see what's really hidden here. Oh, I think this guy won't be very happy with this master's work. Yes, what happened is completely different from what is shown in the picture. Well, let's now move on to the next task. Oh my god, what is this grandpa doing? I don't even want to know what he's hiding behind those bushes. But in order to pass the level, we need to look at this. It turns out this grandpa was just watering the tree. There is nothing wrong. I already had time to get scared and think that he was really standing and peeing. Oh no, this biker accidentally broke his bike by crashing into this tree stump. Wait, what? Does this goat have a saddle on his back? I don't think it's the best replacement for a bike, but this guy and the goat look happy. And this is the main thing. I am very glad that we were able to help them. And now we need to find the right path to the treasure. This is a very strange map. I don't understand what actually needs to be removed here so that we can build a normal path. This is starting to annoy me a little. I also don't understand what actually needs to be removed here. All that is removed here is the flag over the island and the dotted line. Maybe there is a need to remove the dotted line in some specific place? I think we need to try to remove the line starting from the small island and ending with the ship so that our route goes through the top of the island. Well, let's try to do just that. Great, Regatha! Well done! You told us what we needed to do and it turned out to be right! Now we need to free all the teeth! I think we need to remove the braces! Oh, now they won't grow properly! This is very bad! I think he should leave some nice mustache on his face! Just look at this handsome guy! Why doesn't he go to bed? Oh! I think we did something wrong. 
This situation is really extremely unpleasant. What's up with her hair? Was it a wig? Wow, she has quite a trendy haircut. Hello everyone, friends. And today, we will need to remove unnecessary parts from the image. I think he should leave some nice mustache on his face. Yes, this is the best option. The only thing you need to do is remove the sideburns. Just look at this handsome guy. Wait, where did that mustache go? I don't like him bald at all. Now we need to remove some of this. Oh, I think we need to remove this cloud. She definitely prevents this flower from growing. When the sun appears, it will melt this ice and the flower will receive its water. Great. We made it. Do we really need to help this robber find the money now? Oh, here comes the cop. I think it would be better if he goes to jail. It looks like we really need to help this guy after all. Okay, let's find the money. Look, they're at that door. It's bad that we had to help a criminal. Well, let's clean this lamp now. Maybe a genie will emerge from it and fulfill our wishes? We need to do this as carefully as possible so as not to accidentally break it. Let's start with the handle and then wash the rest. And now she looks very cool. Look, it's Jin. It looks like he doesn't want to fulfill our wishes. Well, let's see what this guy actually has under his hat. Wow, he doesn't look like a guardsman at all. It's strange that he even ended up in the royal guard. Well, it's his business and we move on. I don't think her makeup suits her. But it looks like we can't fix it. Well, let's try to remove this cake. There was actually a burger underneath that pie. Do you know who else among us just loves burgers? Now the shadow of this character will appear on your screen. Pause this video and write in the comments who is really hiding under this shadow. I hope you have already written a comment and the correct answer will appear on the screen in three, two, one, and you were right. This is Kinger. Well, dear friends, I hope this was quite easy for you and now we move on. I think these oranges are in danger. It's better to get out of here as soon as possible. It seems to me that this thing is much more dangerous for them than a UFO. And now, we need to help this guy make his car even better in order to please this beauty. Well, let's wash it completely. Maybe it will help somehow. It's amazing that it helped this car. It seems to me that only scrap metal would help her. Well, now this happy guy will take this girl on a date. And we are moving on. This pig really wants to sleep. Why doesn't he go to bed? Maybe he should wash his face. No, it doesn't help. Maybe we should make a bed for him. Oh, I think we did something wrong. It seems to me that these pigs are in for a long, serious conversation. This situation is really extremely unpleasant. Well, let's not embarrass them and move on. And now we need to help the biker who is riding behind the fence. Maybe we need to trim it. No, looks like we need to remove the fence. Wait, what? Why isn't there a motorcycle under it? Is this a biker who doesn't have a bike? But what kind of steering wheel is he holding then? Maybe the truth is hiding behind the rest of the fence? Yes, just look. It's a lawnmower. He's not really a biker. Apparently, this guy wants to seem cooler, but in reality, he is an ordinary lawnmower. Now we need to help this guy get rid of the snake that wants to bite his leg. It seems to me that the problem here is a little different. We need to get this stinky sock out of here. Now this snake is happy because its feet smell like flowers. Well, it's great that we were able to help this snake. And now we move on to the next task. This fox wants to steal the chicken from there. This fox needs to go. Looks like we need to do something different. Oh look, it's a dog inside this chicken coop. This grandma needs help to see better. I think I need to wipe down this weird board. Well, no, it didn't help. Maybe she needs help with something else? Maybe she needs... Oh, wait. What's up with her hair? Was it a wig? Wow, she has quite a trendy haircut. Don't you think so? I actually don't know how this can help her. I think we should try cleaning her glasses. Well, that helped. Cool. Now Granny sees what is drawn on this strange board. Now we need to help this crying zucchini get surgery. It seems to me that for the operation, we won't need this thing and these strange scissors. Let's better remove this scalpel. I really don't want this zucchini to be cut. Well, looks like that didn't help us either. Let's try to do the operation ourselves. Just look. There's a small eggplant inside. Now this eggplant will become a happy mother. And we move on. We need to help this princess see what is really reflected in the mirror. I think we need to wipe this rag off this mirror. Oh, I think this is not at all what she would like to see. I can't say that we were able to help her. But nevertheless, now we are moving on. And now we need to adjust the focus on this camera. I think it's logical enough if we have to press some buttons, but I think we just need to wipe the screen because it was dirty. 
The problem here was not focusing at all. Now this guy will take a beautiful photo. And we need it now. Wait, what is Godzilla doing here? I don't think it's evil at all. Maybe we should see what's really hiding in the shadows. Just look, she has Christmas trees on her back. I thought that she was not evil at all. She just wants to bring Christmas trees for these people to celebrate. It's cool that we were able to help this Godzilla do a good deed. Oh my God, does this guy have a stone PlayStation 5? We need to help him turn it on somehow. I think we should start with a gamepad. You definitely can't turn on anything with this gamepad. Oh, cool. Now this console works. We were able to help this guy. We need to help this girl fulfill her dream so that she can get to France. I think there's something wrong with this window. Yes, just look. Now she's actually in France. This girl still uses wired headphones? Come on, it's already 2024. Let's remove these wires completely. That's better. Now these headphones will finally not be constantly tangled in your pocket. Oh look, there's something wrong with this astronaut. This alien wanted to impersonate an astronaut, but he smiles so sweetly. It seems to me that this alien is not evil at all. Is Grandma playing video games? I think I need to take the gamepad out of her hands. She must be knitting or something. Let's better help her play games. Maybe something happened to her image on TV. Well, let's try to fix it. Just look, this granny plays a game where you have to knit. Wow. Knitting simulator? Sounds pretty weird, but she seems to like it. Well... Now, let's help this grandpa. He has the same problem as the grandmother from the last task. I think his TV is actually hidden behind the curtain. Let's try to remove this curtain and check if he's really there. Yes, here he is. Great, we helped this grandpa. Well, let's now move on to the next task. Just look at this rainbow turd and his hairy butt. When he poops, this guy's butt shakes so funny, it's like he's straining really hard to do it. What, the fish that ate the fish that ate the fish? Lord, do you see what vile things fly out of them? This girl wants to increase her size. I think we did it wrong, but it is not important. The main thing yeah. is that she is happy. Hello everyone, friends. And no matter how happy I am about this, today we are playing a game in which you need to pull out poop. Looks like this guy is stuck in the desert and needs moisture. What lets help him? It's good that this game starts with some kind of adequate task. I'm tired of squeezing pimples and taking out poop every time. Don't be such a boring regatta. This game is pretty fun. In addition to moments with pimples and poop, there are also good tasks like what we are doing now. We helped this guy, and now he will definitely survive. This is great news. I'm very happy about this. Well, now, let's move on to another task. We need to help the pirate there open the treasure. I didn't think we'd have to dig it up. Well, let's try to do this as soon as possible. So far, I don't see any treasure among this dirt. And here is the chest. Well, now we need to figure out how we can open it. I still can't understand what we need to do. Why do we need this stone? Maybe we need to fill this hole? Great! Yes, this is what needed to be done. Okay, now this pirate has hidden the treasure and he will definitely not tell anyone where it is. And we move on to the next task. What? The fish that ate the fish that ate the fish? I understand we need to get the smallest fish of them all. I think it will be quite difficult, but let's try to do it. Oh, we hooked a fish! This hook doesn't help us in any way, so let's just get this fish ourselves. And now we need to get a little fish. Great! We got through it! Well, now all the fish are free, but they are still hungry. Why are they angry at that big brown fish? I can't understand this. Now let's do the next task. It really was quite strange. Oh, just look. This girl wants to increase her size. Um, I won't say that she wants to increase her size so as not to traumatize the psyche of our little subscribers. I still can't understand that she wants to make herself bigger. It's like it's trying to put contact lenses in its eyes. But why then were we pointed to her t-shirt? Something is clearly not right here. I think we did it wrong, but it is not important. The main thing yeah. is that she is happy. Our task is completed and we can finally move on to the next task. This guy wants to beat up the kangaroo? But why does he want to do this? Wait, points us to her bag? What? Should we take her baby out of her pouch and give it to this guy? This task is too cruel. I would never do this in my life. This guy chose the most cruel way to influence his opponent. It seems to me that it is inhumane to put pressure on the enemy with the help of his children. He shouldn't have done that. This is too cruel. I hope that someday the kangaroo will take revenge on him and steal his child from him in the same way. Well, let's leave these two alone and move on to the next task in this game. I think this cow has something stuck in her butt and we need to help get it out. 
Oh, I think she ate too many leaves that were not digested in her stomach, and now we need to clean out her intestines so that she feels good. It's very strange that the cow's stomach couldn't digest the grass. This is their main diet. Well, it doesn't matter. The main thing is that we helped her. Just look how happy she is. I would like everyone we helped to be as happy as she is. Oh, no. Just don't say that now we have to squeeze pimples. Yes, this is exactly this task. Well, let's help this girl make her skin beautiful. In fact, pimples should not be squeezed. They should disappear from your skin naturally. When people squeeze pimples, they can cause an infection or damage the skin so that it never recovers. We only have one nasty pimple left to squeeze. Lord, do you see what vile things fly out of them? Well, the main thing is that we help this girl. And I hope that we won't see any more tasks with acne today. I can't believe you actually said that. Usually you really liked all the tasks with all sorts of nasty things. This crazy guy was going to eat five hot chili peppers at once. I think his stomach will turn into boiling lava. I think it's hotter than KFC wings. He has already eaten four peppers, and not a single muscle on his face has moved. This guy's really flint. He seems to really like the spiciness of this dish and is very happy with what he ate. He is so happy because he still has no idea what awaits him when all this food is digested. But it seems to me that these are the consequences of those same peppers. Well, Pomni, these are your favorite tasks. Just look at this rainbow turd and his hairy butt. This looks very funny. When he poops, this guy's butt shakes so funny, it's like he's straining really hard to do it. Oh my god. I really hope that someday we will stop playing these disgusting games and we'll only play something really interesting and fun. Now we need to get the leeches out of this guy's hand. Is it just me? Or have the nasty task started again? Those leeches took a lot of this guy's blood. I hope he doesn't have any health problems after this. It seems to me that these bites may have consequences. In fact, in some countries, leeches are used to suck bad blood out of the body because they prefer to drink it. So I think you shouldn't worry about this guy's health. He was simply given health procedures. But mosquitoes, on the contrary, can be breeding grounds for infection because they can drink infected blood before and then bite you and transfer this infection to you. Now we need to help this girl. She definitely has some problems while she's in the shower. Oh, this is another task in which we do some strange things. What did we do? I cannot understand. Someday we will find out what it really was. For now, let's just move on to the next task. Now we need to help this girl fix her car. I can't figure out what this part actually is, but it's definitely some kind of mechanical thing that girls don't understand. Well, the main thing is to make this car move so that this girl can finally go about her business. Oh no, this guy got his heart broken. We need to help him deal with his heartache. Let's quickly help him get rid of unnecessary memories so that he can concentrate on the one and only love of his life. He was in love with two other girls at once besides the one who was still in his heart. It's really quite strange. It seems to me that this guy has problems not with his heart, but with his head. But now he has the one and only one. Look, the next guy wants to propose to his girlfriend. We need to help him place the ring on her finger. This guy has a really funny hairstyle. I hope this doesn't influence her decision. So let's choose which finger we will place this ring on. I actually don't really remember which finger this ring is supposed to be on. Do you really not see the lines around your finger where you need to put this ring? Guys, don't be so stupid. You have already tried all the fingers except the one you need. Thanks for the tip. I didn't notice this line at all. Well, now they are happy. Husband and wife. Just look at this guy eating candy right out of the wrapper. Does he love sweets that much? One day, my cat ate a sausage straight with the wrapper, and then she ran around with the cellophane wrapper sticking out of her butt. And my cat was once playing with a balloon that had a ribbon attached to it. After he burst the balloon, he started chewing the tape, swallowed it, and then it stuck out of his butt. I absolutely don't understand why you are telling these stories now. Okay, doesn't matter. The main thing is that we helped this strange guy. Let's move on to the next task. What awaits us next? What awaits us next is the suffering of this game. And if you're talking about the level, then some idiot swallowed the fish skeleton again. How can this even be done? He was lucky that this skeleton came out so easily, and it did not cling to the walls of his esophagus. Well, great. We helped this guy, and let's move on to the next task. I wonder what will happen there. Looks like this guy has some stomach problems. Let's take a closer look. Oh no, he was hit by a bullet. You need to get it out with these tweezers. God, how disgusting this is. Either the tweezers are too small, or the bullet is too big. 
It fits into the hole in his skin too easily. Well, the main thing is that we helped this guy, and now we can move on to the next level. I hope he will be healthy now. What's going on here? Did she vacuum the cat directly into the vacuum cleaner, and now we need to get him out of there? It seems to me that there are some problems with the size here too. Either this cat is too small, or she has a giant vacuum cleaner. Yes, this cat really looks tiny compared to this vacuum cleaner. Well, it's quite difficult to get it out of there. He keeps getting stuck inside that pipe. You need to be as careful as possible and not harm him. Great! We're almost there! Just a little left. We're almost out of this vacuum cleaner. Great! Now his owner will be happy and the cat will return to her. Well, let's now move on to the next task. Oh no, this bear is stuck in a trap. He is crying. I'm so sorry for this bear. We urgently need to help him. Well, I hope we can help this bear and he will roam joyfully through his forest again. Let's open this trap and free his leg as soon as possible. This trap is so gigantic. No wonder this bear was crying because he was stuck in it. He really looks like he can break even a bear's bones. This damn trap doesn't want to come off. Great, we got it done. Now the bear will be happy. But of course, he needs a little time to recover. Oh no, they put him in a cast and now he won't be able to walk for some time. What now? Let's help this guy. Looks like he wants a hairstyle like his favorite football player. This guy has very long hair and he wants a short haircut. Well, let's help him with this. I'm so sorry to shave off his long hair. Well, look, I think we can leave him with this hairstyle and he will look like my grandfather. It seems to me that he will very much regret in the future the choice of his hairstyle. But since he asked, we will definitely do it. Okay, we made this guy completely bald. Let's see what happens now. It seems to me that he is very happy with his new hairstyle, but it doesn't suit him very well. Okay, let's move on to the next level. Oh no, this guy's toilet is clogged and now we need to help him clean it out. I wonder what could be stuck in this toilet that prevents the water from leaving. That was a pretty stupid question. Of course there was poop stuck in there. I think they need to be moved a little in the other direction. No one cleans the poop out of the toilet. I can't believe we do this every time. We really go into this game, squeeze out pimples, push poop somewhere, and are you all really happy with it? I can't say that I'm happy, but our viewers really like this game, and that's why we have to film it. Oh my god, just look. This poop is stuck in the toilet. Looks like there's too much water in there. It doesn't go through this pipe. I remember that at the very beginning of the level, a plunger was shown. Maybe this guy should have given it to us so we could unclog this toilet. This turd just doesn't want to go down through that water. We really need some kind of tool to push it through. She just doesn't want to go through this water, and unfortunately the water can't be pushed through. Maybe he needs to press the drain button because we can't do it. Oh my god, it's really very difficult. Maybe we should skip this level or try to go through it again. This really seems impossible to me. We won't skip this level because it's for weaklings. Let's just try to pull it straight down with all our might and maybe we'll get something done. It didn't go all the way, but the game counted us a victory. Great. I think this guy will still be able to wash it off completely. Now let's move on to the next task. Looks like this guy dropped his mouse container. Now he needs to put them all back together. It's strange that these mice don't move or run away from us. It's like they just froze. It's good that they don't run away, because then this task would become almost impossible for us. And now we can just calmly collect all these mice in a container, and we won't worry about them jumping out or running away. All that remains is to place this mouse and another one in the container. Let's get this over with as quickly as possible and move on to the next task. I really want to see what awaits us next. Judging by the fact that these mice do not move at all, it seems to me that they are not very alive. Yes. It seems that since they smell disgusting, it means they really don't live anymore. Well, let's not think about it, but let's help this kid with his problem. I think he has a fever. He is crying. We need to help him get better. Okay, we need to put this pill directly into his mouth and help him drink it down. Why is she so bouncy? Well, there's a tablet inside, and now let's fill it with water. Oh my god! Is this supposed to be pressure from a fire hydrant? This is not the end of this task! Now we need to help these microbes defeat the virus inside it. Well, let's put these microbes inside so that the baby is healthy and happy. Well, there's one more microbe left and great. He's inside this guy's body. Now he sleeps peacefully and doesn't cry. Nothing bothers him. Okay, let's move on to the next task. I hope we don't have to help them have a baby this time. Great, 
This time we need to help Cupid get straight into this girl's heart. Well, this building was pretty easy, and now let's quickly move on to the next one. I'm very interested in what awaits us next. Look, it's the platypus from the cartoon. I remember watching this cartoon when I was a child. Well, we need to help him get into the secret tunnel through the trash can. Okay, let's do this. It seems to me that he is a little unable to fit into this tunnel. I try to pull him down with all my strength, but he absolutely does not want to climb there. Maybe it needs to be pushed there somehow using this lid. I think there is some kind of error going on. We're really trying to shove it right into that trash can. We can't do anything! I can't understand what we're doing wrong. Maybe we can skip this level after all. No guys, we definitely don't need to skip this level. We definitely have to come up with something that will help us pass this level. Maybe let's try closing this trash can with a lid. Maybe he just doesn't want to climb into this bucket because he's afraid that someone will notice him. Well, that sounds pretty logical. Great, it really helped us pass this level. Well, now we need to get him to the elevator. Great, we passed this level. This was the most difficult level of all today.